Due to the large amount of staff and students using ePortfolio, there has been a file quota added of 150 megabytes of file storage. This means that the total amount of files you have added as attachments in ePortfolio must not exceed 150 megabytes limit. You can see your current usage anywhere in ePortfolio where you can attach a file. Here's an example. In my blog, I'm going to add a blog post. And then when I scroll down, you can see that I have used 3.05 megabytes of my 150 megabyte total. To remove some of the files, access the file store from the front page. The list of files currently in the ePortfolio is displayed alongside the context of the attachment. So for example, I can see this document called bfr.doc is attached on a blog post called test. When deleting a file from this area, it does not immediately come off your quota. This will remove the file to the recycle bin. The recycle bin is a safety net in case it deletes something in error and files can be restored from here using the restore button. To delete a file permanently, select delete. And the quota will now have been reduced by the size of the deleted file.